What is up, YouTube Bunny Films here with a brand new video. So today, I'm bringing you a tutorial. I have been doing a lot, of, or I've been doing a bunch of these, like, wood glitch thingies. So here's an example of what I'm doing. I'm doing, like, an, a wooden, like, a cool window thing, as you, as you saw in the thumbnail. I don't know really what to call it, but I'm just going to call it the cool window. So this is the cool window. Excuse me. There's a car on me, or a car near me. So this is the window. This is extremely simple. And basically, and there's no exploits, nothing needed. It's just basically blueprints from this game put together. So what you need, um, you need two um, wooden ladders that can be purchased over at Wood R Us in the blueprint section, and then you need one window pane that is four by four. So here are the materials over there. You're here. Excuse me. So you might want to build the, this window if you want to be like, if you're interested in build. If no. You might want to build this window if you want to do medieval building stuff in Lumber Tycoon 2 and stuff. But basically, um, I would also encourage you having the wood, the same type of wood as your surrounding wall. Because that will make it much nicer. So you want to start by either, um, let's start by taking the glass pane. And this does take a little bit of time, guys. So hopefully you do not mind the time. Hopefully you have a lot of time on your hands to make this. But basically... Here's the house. You want to put the window pane in here, and then you want to reload. You want to press load, and then reload. This Okay, YouTube. So, um, when you have your base back in, um, you want to press, uh, you want to select your land and then confirm your load. But then you want to rush over to where you built that wall. I think I was a bit behind, and you want to press E on that window and then press Move. So let's see if we can get over there before it finishes loading in. It does work easier for bigger bases like this. So you want to press Move and then press V quit, and then you'll notice the window is gone. So like you can go through here and stuff. But then the window will reappear once you load in. But other players will still see the window, but you won't. And the window will there, be there, so you can place the ladders there. But we do have to reload one more time, and then one time, one more time after that to see the finished product. So here's the empty window. Now you want to take one of your ladders that matches the wall surrounding it. And you want to place it inside like that. Ooh, no, no, no. no. I'm sorry. And you want to place it inside like that. And now... Um, that's not what it'll look like in the end. Now I'm going to go to menu, or I have to wait 60 seconds, so I'm going to um, speed forward this video. Also, I'm speeding ahead, so in case people don't accuse me of using um, hacks or exploits, so I'll just speed this through. And I think that's Dennis. That or like That's a Dennis thing shirt. Anyways, yeah, let's continue this speed thing in between. Shout out to Gav Gav one two three four five six seven eight nine. He likes my videos. So that's a big thumbs up. Shout out to Gav Gav one two three four five six seven eight nine. He also likes the vending thing. Okay, YouTube. So we are back, and um, so right before you load in, you want to be next to where your window is. Uh, and you want to press E, and then you can see around where I am. I'm right down there with my cursor. So you want to be in front of the window, and then press confirm. I pressed E. So here it will go. So first you want to press move on the window, and then press B quit. And then you want to do that for the next ladder too. So let's wait for this to load. Mm, come on, come on. There's ladder, move, and then B quit. There we go, guys. So the window is empty right now. No, like you can go through it. There you go. But once you reload again, then you'll see the ladder in the window there. But once we finish loading in, you want to take your ladder, which we will do in a moment. So here we go. Here is our ladder. And then press T on it. So it's like this sideways because first one we placed it upright like you would climb it. Now we're placing it sideways like a railing. So this person's sort of getting in the way. Um, I think he's just amazed how I'm get f going through this thing. 
<laughs> okay. So anyway, so you're gonna take the ladder, you're gonna place it on the opposite way, the opposite way, like opposite way you placed it, and then you're gonna place it in the little hole like that. And there we go. So now it looks like a jail cell. And then you wanna go menu, load, two minutes. Oh wait, I have to wait. So I'm gonna speed this up again, guys. Um <clears throat> and then yeah, so I I do um I will not say that this works for every single base. I think bases that are like too small, like data size less than four, I think, or three, uh, won't be able to do this in time because it lo uh, it'll load too quickly. But mine is data size five, so anyone at data size five or above should have it working perfectly fine for them. So let's speed this up again. Okay, YouTube, so we're going to load in, and of course, if you watch through the time lapses, then you will know that's 100% legit, no exploits, nothing, and no, Defaultiel will not ban you for doing this. I got to comment asking if you would get banned, and he's still trying to get through the window, <laughs> pretty funny. So now we have to wait for the ladders to load in, give it a few minutes, not a few minutes, give it a minute or a moment. Oh, there we go, guys. So we have the barred window, like medieval window, whatever you want to call it cool window i posted it on twitter earlier today and people are asking how did you make this where do you buy this but like no you don't buy this anywhere it's simple easy thing to do you just need a large base um that will load that will reload slowly and yeah so thank you for watching this video guys stay tuned for more videos that will be coming up in the near future also enter my roblox gift card giveaway it will be ending this saturday not april 8th that was my mistake but it will be ending april I mean, this Saturday, guys. Let's see what day that is. Uh, it'll be ending April 1st, guys. So, April Fool's Day. And no, this is not a joke, either. It's not going to be anything related to uh, April Fool's or anything. So, yeah. Don't worry about that. Enter my giveaway. Also, comment below what you want me to build next. Also, if you're for my notification squad, hello. And everyone else, have a great day. And, yeah. Have a fantastic day, everyone.